I will sign your damn confession if you agree to get tested as my bone marrow donor. That would give me a lot of power. It means I could save your life and maybe put you back in jail. <laughs> well, I guess that's a risk I'm gonna have to take. be hurting people. Richie, that's your territory. Fine. Whatever. Hey, but there is one more thing. Oh, what? Another condition for my reprieve? No, it's just a question. If this transplant works out, if you actually get another chance, what do you plan on doing with your life? You're smart, Richie. Why don't you do something great with your life? I'm gonna do what I've always done, I'm gonna survive. You know what I think? No, what do you think? Please tell me. I think you are scared to death because you have spent so much of your life focused on one thing, punishing me, that you don't have a clue what to do now. But you better figure it out, Richie, because you are done abusing me. People with death sentences don't spend a lot of time thinking about the future. Okay. You say I could change, turn things around? Well, I just don't think so. I, I, I don't think I can be anything else than what I am now. I don't know exactly where that train leads. It goes straight to hell. I'm serious, Annie. I don't think that I could change. But you were honest with me. It gives me some hope that maybe one day you'll be able to turn off that switch and actually do the right thing. Not just for yourself, but for the rest of us. Well, I won't make any promises. And I'm not expecting any. I probably wouldn't believe him anyway. Stop whatever it is that you're doing. You have to stop. I'm calling okay. security. It's my husband. It's okay. You don't understand. This man is very dangerous, okay? He's a dangerous man. Whatever he convinced you to do, Annie, Ryan. it's not okay. Ryan, I came here on my own. What? What are you talking about? That's right, Boy Scout. Annie's here to save my life. 